Hi, my name is Pete Aguilar. I am running for Congress to represent you, the people of the 31st District of California. I am a husband, a father, the mayor, and hopefully your next congressman. First, I just want to thank you all for coming and listening to me talk. I'll try and keep this as short and sweet as possible. I'm here to let you know how important this election is and how important you all are in this election. This election can have a major impact on the entire middle class. The middle class is what's important. My election is grounded on good education, job creation, and a stronger middle class. I know here in the Inland Empire, where I grew up, how hard it can be. I've worked my entire life. I worked my way through all of school, even college. I had to take out loans, but it was worth it. I graduated with two degrees, and now I'm the mayor of Redwood. I still may have those loans, though. I am now raising my children with my loving wife in the same city I grew up in. I am committed so that every young child and all of your children all get the same opportunity. The opportunity at an education. An opportunity at the American dream. I promise you, I will never stop fighting. Now, as mentioned, the middle class is the drive behind this all. A strong middle class starts with our children. There is nothing more important than ensuring the best education, preparing them for the future. The middle class also depends on our economy. That is why I will be raising. That is why I will be raising the minimum wage. We also need to pass equal pay legislation. I'm worried about the economy as a whole. That means inequality to the middle class as well as women as well as women. This also means corporations will pay their fair share. I will do everything I can to encourage the discontinuation of outsourcing so they only hire locally. This alone will create many more job opportunities. My opponent has talked about how he would like to raise the minimum age to retire. I, on the other hand, think that proposal is one of disgrace. Our future and our kids' future is important, and I will continue to support senior citizens. When you spend your whole life working hard and putting your money into a retirement fund, taking care of your family, providing for your family, you deserve respect. You deserve respect for all that you have done in your life. When you retire, you deserve dignity. Speaking about dignity, I know the hardships many of you face with deportation of your family members. I'm here to tell you that that is wrong and will not be tolerated if I am elected. The deportation rate in this district alone is higher than it ever should be. I've lived here. I know what it's like. You all deserve to be with your family. My stance on immigration is strong, and I will be heard. Another issue I would like to talk about is that of our military men and women. They are the true heroes. They are the bravest amongst us. They put their life on the line for us every day, and they deserve health care, job training, and family support family support when they get home. All of these issues are what I will fight for. If you want someone, a voice, that can represent you, that can stand up for you on all of these topics and more, I'm your man. I will stand up for the middle class, invest in education, work for student loan reform, stop deportation, and bring more jobs home to you. If this sounds like something you're interested in, then I'm your representative.